And now, a Canadian moment. Hi, Charlie. What do you mean, hi, Charlie? You've got some nerve. Where'd you get off saying something like that to me? I don't talk to you that way. Dieting again? Yeah. Huh? <laughs> well, Kretzky and Bouchard are going at it again over separation. Mm-hmm. The Prime Minister says he will not allow another referendum vote unless the wording of the question is clear. Well, what does he have in mind? Something like, okay, for sure, on that day, I so like separate thing or what, huh? <laughs> Well, Quebec certainly is a unique culture. Can you believe that they are going to spend $7 million on a liquor museum? We already have a liquor museum. It's called Jacques Parizeau. <laughs> hi, Sam. Hi, Vera. Hi, Charlie. What do you mean, hi, Charlie? Look, I'm doing the best I can, okay? The diet? Yeah. <laughs> so what do you make of us pulling our troops out of Kosovo? Oh, I got the solution there, Charlie. I think they should be replaced with a group that's more intimidating. Who is more intimidating than Canadian soldiers? Squeegee kids. <laughs> Did you hear they sold shoppers drug mart to Americans? They should have sold it to a Canadian who knows a lot about the drug business. Like who? Ben Johnson. <laughs> Ontario's going to privatize prisons. What? Private companies are going to run them? Oh, yeah. Instead of correctional facilities, they'll be called Prison Mart, Inmate World, and Cells R Us. <laughs> What do you make of Jean Chrétien promising to build a new school in Turkey where they had that earthquake? Good move by Chrétien. If he does build a new school, it means no student will ever get hurt in an earthquake again. How do you figure, Sam? Well, first they build a Canadian school. Then naturally there'll be cutbacks to education funding. So it becomes impossible to maintain the school, it closes down, and next time there's an earthquake, there'll be no students in the school to get hurt. Sam, you've got to cut down on the sugar. You see, Wayne Gretzky went into the Hall of Fame. Wayne Gretzky, Wayne Gretzky, all I hear is Wayne did this, Wayne said that. People talk like he is the second coming. All because he scored a few damn goals and retired. And now he's in every magazine article and every newspaper editorial. It is impossible to get through one single day without Wayne Gretzky. Wayne this, Gretzky that, Wayne, 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 Wayne. Well, as far as I am concerned, Wayne can take his Tylenol doctor's orders, fill up his car with Esso gas, and go away. Did you hear? Wayne Gretzky went into the hall of fame. <laughs> To honor his greatness, they permanently retired number 99. They retired 99 from all NHL teams? No, they retired the actual number 99. From now on, when you count, it'll be 96, 97, 98, 100. <laughs> you got that right. You betcha. Tell me about it. Oh, yeah. Oh, yeah. This has been a Canadian Tell me about it.